this is um, this is some of my coriander. I've got uh, coriander all over the garden, and uh, it's it's uh, starting to uh, well, it's not bolting. It's it's going to flower. It's it's had a longer season. It was planted in uh, in uh, August. Um, been eating it all all winter, and now we're heading into spring. It's heading up. Now this might be a, you might think this is a disaster. Lots of people complain. Oh, I've got coriander. It always bolts. Well, it's it it has a, a has a pretty flower, and um, it's still all, all all of this. If you look at all of this, it's all all beautiful. Keep eating it. Well, the the only problem with um, uh, coriander bolting is um, or sending up flowers is that it's um, if you're marketing it and uh, sending it to market, but it's still was um, even when it's finely cut, it's still very tasty. Um, Anyway, um, I've got some footage of, um, uh, I'll just show you the rest of the um, coriander in the garden and then I'll, um, I'll show you some footage of the, of the fox and uh, good news, fox cubs, which is pretty exciting. Got some, some more um, coriander over here, if you remember a couple of months ago I was um, eating this. I'm going to remove the clutches in, uh, entirely uh, soon. More coriander. Uh, see how that's yellowing. That's because it's been in the not a rain shadow, but in a spring in um, a hose pipe shadow. So all of this mizuna has been um, uh, stopping the rain getting to uh, the water getting to the um, coriander. I've got more coriander over here as well. Got coriander everywhere. All hidden in in the way behind mustard and, and so on. More coriander down there. Oh, coriander here. We're fond of it in this house. Anyway, off to, uh, I'll show you the uh, fox cubs. Yeah, I think so. I don't... There's a, a fox cub. Can you see him? Oh, <laughs> oh and another. Yeah, yeah, no, I think the father's just pushed him into camera shot. I'm, yeah, both of them. I, I'm going to make you a star on YouTube. That's what I'm going to do. That's what he's saying. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how clear a shot it is. But, uh... Yeah, but there was another adult, and then uh, he pushed he pushed two grey ones in uh, tiny little things in front of me. Yeah, you can smell me, can't you? And it's typical. That's what a great stalker I am. And I'm sitting up wind of them. The. Uh... <laughs> Right, I'm going to go downwind, see if I can get them to... Can you see them? They're blending really nicely against the asbestos. Oh, they're so cute! <laughs> We think that's the mother. Um, it looks very thin, thinner than um, before. Probably took it out of there. She seems to be standing on guard. Actually, you can't blame her. The little ones have gone in. 
And they're so um, comfortable about human beings. You know, if they were really wild animals, they would have hidden the moment they heard us. Can you see him? Tiny little thing. that wheelbarrow. I don't know if you can see them. I'm going to come back with my posh camera so we can get a closer shot. Uh, no, it's, it, it's, the, it's the mum and the... It's, I, I, it's the grass is so long I can't see them. drinking um, her milk, I think. So I can see little dark shapes underneath her belly moving around. But, uh, there's a blade of grass in the way, I've got it zoomed in as far as I can. But it's really cute, every now and again she 